Are you ready to take that bold step towards financial freedom? I genuinely hope you're prepared to embark on this thrilling journey. Welcome, dear listener, to a comprehensive ride that will not only transform the way you think about building your wealth, but also immerse you in the rich history and evolution of stock trading. This is no ordinary guide on how to start trading stocks as a complete beginner. Since the genesis of stock trading in the 17th century with the Dutch East India Company, to its evolution into the technologically driven mechanism of today, the world of stocks has been a fascinating journey. You're here, at the precipice of a new realm of understanding, prepared to dive headfirst into a timeline spanning centuries of financial possibilities. By stepping into this world, you're not just a curious bystander anymore. You're a participant. You're part of this exciting saga, this vast universe of stocks teeming with potential history, and I'm here to guide you through it. Hello there. By tuning in, you've already embarked on an exciting journey into the world of stock trading. It's not just about learning how to buy and sell stocks, but about understanding their history, their evolution, and the forces that have shaped them. Delve into the labyrinth of stock markets, decipher patterns and rhythms that have governed it over centuries. It's about becoming one with the ebb and flow of stocks and appreciating the historical significance of this financial endeavor. Today, I'll guide you through everything you need to know to get started, from the origins of the stock exchange to the modern dynamics of trading. We'll explore the terminology, concepts, strategies, and most importantly, the mindset required for trading stocks successfully. We will discuss how to analyze stocks, understand trends, and make informed decisions. We will talk about the psychology of trading, the importance of patience, discipline, and risk management. Trading stocks may seem daunting initially, but understanding its history and evolution makes it a riveting journey. And that's precisely what this guide aims to provide, a comprehensive understanding of the stock market and its evolution over the years. It's not just about trading, it's about transforming yourself into a savvy trader, well versed with the legacy of the stock market. So let's break it down into simple, actionable steps. Remember, the journey of a thousand miles begins with a single step. So buckle up and let's take that first step together towards diving deep into the world of stock trading and your financial freedom. Step one, grasp the basics. Before venturing into the unknown territories of stock trading, it's of utmost significance to acquire a solid understanding of its fundamental principles. These core elements will form the stronghold of all your future trading expeditions, thus making it indispensable for you to comprehend them meticulously to elevate your chances of success. Firstly, let's elucidate what we mean by stock. In the simplest terms, stocks signify a share of ownership in a corporation. Their types can vary, common stocks, which allow shareholders voting rights and a portion of the company's profit through dividends, and preferred stocks, which guarantee a fixed dividend but do not provide voting rights. When you procure, you procure a stock, you're essentially investing in a fragment of that corporation, making you a partial proprietor, thus making you eligible for a cut in the company's earnings. Furthermore, stock trading predominantly transpires on platforms termed exchanges. These are essentially marketplaces where the buying and selling of stocks occur. Some globally acknowledged ones include the New York Stock Exchange, NYSE, and the National Association of Securities Dealers Automated Quotations, NASDAQ. However, innumerable other exchanges exist worldwide, each presenting its own unique attributes and characteristics. One fundamental concept that you need to acquaint yourself with is market orders. This term refers to directives given to a broker to purchase or sell a stock at the current market price. Unlike limit orders, which dictate a price at which the order must be executed, market orders are fulfilled at the most favorable available price. Market orders function on a first-come, first-served basis and are usually executed in seconds during standard market conditions. Market orders are typically used when the speed of execution holds more weightage than the price at which the order is filled. They're ideal for buying and selling stocks that showcase high liquidity and steady prices. However, they carry the potential to lead to losses if the market portrays volatility and the stock's price fluctuates rapidly between the time of order placement and its execution. Bear in mind that while these principles might seem straightforward, their practical application can often be quite intricate. As such, it's vital to invest time in learning these cornerstone concepts, as they will assist in steering your trading decisions and strategies. Achieving a clear understanding of these basics will ensure that you approach stock trading equipped with the right mindset and tools. 
empowering you to traverse the markets with confidence. Step 2. Opt for the right brokerage. In your journey to successfully navigating the stock market, your next crucial step is selecting a fitting brokerage account. Why is this choice so significant? This decision has the power to shape the direction of your investment journey. Your brokerage account serves as your access point to the intricate and expansive universe of the stock market. It operates as your command center, where you'll execute your trades, manage your portfolio, and scrutinize market fluctuations. So, how do you decide on the right brokerage? There are several key factors to deliberate. Initially, cost is a major consideration. The desire to maximize investment returns is universal, and a direct method to achieve that is by minimizing the fees associated with your trades. In simpler terms, lower fees translate into higher profits. Therefore, prioritize platforms that boast low fees. Next, ponder over the interface. Given the swift pace of stock trading, a seamless, user-friendly interface can serve as a treasured feature. It can simplify your trading process, enabling speedy and efficient trade execution. An added bonus would be if the platform has a visually appealing and easy-to-navigate interface. The third factor to consider is the availability of research tools. The stock market operates on information. The more knowledge you have access to, the better equipped you are to make informed trading decisions. Comprehensive research tools can equip you with insights into market trends, company performance, and economic indicators. Some platforms even offer real-time news updates, keeping you abreast with the most recent information. Now, let's delve deeper into the process of selecting a brokerage and look at the pros and cons of different platforms. Some platforms might offer an array of features but may not be user-friendly, especially for beginners. Others might have easy-to-use interfaces but may lack in terms of advanced features for experienced traders. Some platforms might offer lower fees but might not provide a comprehensive range of research tools. And there might be platforms with excellent customer service but higher fees. Choosing the right brokerage is about more than ticking off a list of features. It's about finding a platform that meets your individual needs and investment ambitions. For newbies, platforms with robust educational resources might be beneficial. For experienced traders, advanced charting capabilities might be more appealing. Different platforms cater to different types of traders, so it's imperative to find one that aligns with your trading style. Furthermore, don't forget the importance of customer service, an often overlooked factor. When dealing with your hard-earned money, the assurance that help is available when you need it is crucial, so be patient. Thoroughly research different platforms, scrutinize their offerings, deliberate on their advantages and drawbacks. I'm here to walk you through the process of selecting a brokerage and setting up your account, ensuring you're ready to start trading in no time. Step 3. Carve out a strategy. Successful trading demands a robust plan. Whether you're keen on day trading, swing trading, or long-term investing, will assist you in defining your goals and crafting a strategy that suits you. Bear in mind, consistency and discipline are crucial. Adhere to your plan and steer clear of emotion-driven decisions. And there you have it, a beginner's guide to trading stocks. With commitment, education, and practice, you'll be on your way to building wealth through the stock market. Thanks for joining me today. Wishing you profitable trading. Eager to commence your trading journey? Subscribe to our channel for more tips, tutorials, and expert advice on mastering the stock market.